The latest example of the power of the Internet. It's not a viral video. It's not a singer on a talent show. In fact, it's not a video at all. It is a T-shirt, a simple, ordinary T-shirt, which has rocketed to the number one spot in apparel sales on Amazon.com and done it for the strangest of reasons. Here's David Wright. Why do wolves howl at the moon? The truth is, nobody knows. Why has this T-shirt become an overnight sensation? Nobody's quite sure of that either. But the answer has something to do with irony and the internet. I was searching for a book for school, and the Amazon recommendation system had actually suggested that I might like the Three Wolf Moon T-shirt. Six months ago, Brian Govern posted a satiric comment on the Amazon website about this T-shirt he doesn't even own. It fit my girthy frame. It has wolves on it and it attracts women. His review started a phenomenon. More than 750 others have since offered their own over-the-top testimonials. One said, you don't put this t-shirt on your torso, you put it on your soul. Another said wolves would be better if they glowed in the dark. Three Wolf Moon has even inspired a new YouTube video mashing together music from Pocahontas and lyrics from Amazon.com. And you can yield its awesome powers for 914. Random have people with a sense of humor have made Three Wolf Moon an internet celebrity. The strange thing is the Three Wolf Moon t-shirt has actually been on sale for a couple of years now. And for most of that time, they were selling maybe a couple of t-shirts a day. As of last week, though, sales suddenly spiked. Now they're selling more than 100 an hour, outselling all their other t-shirts combined. You can find a picture online pretty much of anyone wearing this shirt. There's possibly one of you wearing this shirt online, you know? <laughs> a marketing blitz the tiny t-shirt company in New Hampshire had nothing to do with. They just make the t-shirts. And what does it say to you when you see this design now? Money. <laughs> These days, they're howling all the way to the bank. David Wright, ABC News, Keene, New Hampshire.